We're going to have a great year in 2024 at CMH and we have a lot of projects that are ahead of us but none as big as our construction project with our hospital expansion. We already have the parking lot completed just to the south of the Cancer Center and that will be reserved during construction for our hospital employees. Our next project that we're going to uh, work on is the parking lot to the north of the hospital. We have several offices that need to be relocated to different areas to get us ready for uh, the actual construction of the tower. The old HR building is going to be uh, demolished as a part of the excavation right before we start building the tower and there's several offices there that need to be moved. Our patient accounting department is going to be moving from the hospital to the uh, Broadway professional building. Um, and then there's going to be some other office relocations in the hospital to make room for nutritional services. We're going to have to move the cafeteria from its current location to the north side of the hospital and the uh, community rooms are going to provide uh, dining space for our employees and for the community. But we expect that uh, around the April timeline we're going to have the temporary kitchen set up, um, have those rooms uh, ready for dining space. Um, we also are working on plans to continue to provide uh, catering services to our civic organizations in our community and we uh, have been working on a partnership with the Lime Bank to have some uh, community room space available that CMH can cater and we'll begin operations there the first part of February. I think you've seen recently that we've had to close down parking lots and um, do some uh, site work just to get ready for bidding of the project. We've also been working on utility uh, relocation and from time to time it's going to come up where we have to close down a portion of the parking lots to be able to do some pre-work uh, so we're ready for construction. Starting this summer, you're actually going to see the hospital tower uh, being built. And so you're going to see um, between summer and the end of the year, the excavation work and then the actual uh, construction of the tower itself. There's a significant amount of demolition that has to take place. Uh, the HR building is going to come down um, and that will make room for uh, parking in front of the new hospital and then the current cafeteria area will be um, demolished and the tower will connect to the hallway that's directly behind the cafeteria. That's when you'll really start to see the need for people to be patient with us because we're going to be in a construction zone uh, from that point then for the next few years. And I just want to express how much I appreciate everybody willing to work with us as we're making progress. Just a reminder that the total building project for our hospital expansion is going to take close to three years. When we think about what we're going to be able to offer in this new building, the increased uh, access to our emergency room, uh, private patient rooms in the hospital, adequate surgery space, all of this that we're getting ready to go through, which can be kind of a headache as we go through construction, really is going to be such a significant thing for CMH, for Bolivar, for our surrounding communities, uh, that it'll be worth it. And it's exciting to see the progress.